All right, welcome back to Yahoo Finance Live. Miles Edlin here in New York. It's time now for Retirement Ready, brought to you by Fidelity. So we've seen a lot of dislocations in the market. A lot of things about investing now are different than they were just a month ago. How can retirees and savers maybe take advantage of some of that? We're joined now by Julia Carlson. She is the CEO of Financial Freedom. So um, Julia, I think a lot of retirees are, are just normal folks like us saving for retirement have 401ks, IRAs. Um, we're just trying to maybe forget our passwords right now and not look at damage <laughs> that may have been done. Um, but what are some things that we can do? We've talked a little bit on the show about rebalancing your allocations if things got out of whack during the last month. Yeah, th thanks for having me. And of course, if you had a you if you were in retirement and you had a balanced portfolio, then for sure, most likely things got out of whack here. So considering to rebalance your portfolio definitely makes sense. Hopefully that may have happened a, you know, a week ago when, when the markets were lower. We've had quite a comeback here. I, I would not, we are not adding risk to portfolios at this moment, but I think rebalancing to how you should be allocated would be very appropriate. And then we've seen rates come down a lot. Um, you know, there's been many times over the last several years when it's been like, all right, you got to refinance now because rates will never get lower. And then they always did go lower. So um, what are some things that people can do right now maybe to take advantage of those? Yeah, for sure. I would recommend looking at your mortgage and calling your banker, calling your mortgage company, seeing if it does make sense for you to refinance. Uh, also, what we are doing for our clients is looking at Roth conversions. So this could be an opportunity right now where if if maybe you are still working and you, um, well, well, if you if your income is going to get jeopardized this year and you have a lower income, it could make sense to do some Roth conversions at this time and then allow your portfolio to come back and recover inside a Roth IRA. Hey, Julia, Rick Newman. Um, I've seen some reports uh, with concerns that um, some companies that are at risk of closing uh, have 401k plans they administer on behalf of their employees. It could be a couple hundred thousand companies, uh, you know, each with a bunch of employees who would be, would be at risk. It, it sh should you be doing anything if you think you're with your 401k, if you think your company might close or does that just all get worked out? Boy, so it, it would get worked out and it would do it to be able to take action now, you'd have to make sure that your plan uh, had in-service distributions. So if you were concerned about that and your plan allowed for in-service distributions, that would be something that I would consider if your company was going to be at risk of closing. Uh, but it would be figured out. I mean, that is what ERISA is for. Yeah, I guess if your administrator doesn't go out of business, then I guess that your money would be secure in that in that fund. Is that correct? Well, correct. Yes. Yeah. Right. Well, secure in the funds. I don't. I mean, yes, the funds that. I mean, it doesn't guarantee the value, obviously, but yes, you will have those funds in there. All right, Julia Carlson is the CEO of Financial Freedom. Uh, thanks for joining us. Have a great weekend. Yeah. Thank you. Hey investors, Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up to the minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.